Hello, my name is Benjamin Hart. I'm an American attorney and the managing director of Integrity Legal here in Bangkok, Thailand. As the title of this video suggests, we're discussing so-called revenge tourism. And for those who are wondering, what is revenge tourism? That sounds pretty strange. Well, I thought of making this video after reading a recent article in the Patia Mail. That's patiamail.com. Article is titled, Thailand's, quote, revenge tourism, unquote, boom, reflected in Cambodia too. Governments throughout Southeast Asia are pleased with the uptake in foreign arrivals now that the pandemic is decidedly on the wane. The trend amongst travelers is called, quote, revenge tourism, unquote, characterized by people having more extravagant and longer vacation cravings after being cooped up in their houses at the height of the health crisis. Because people have been stuck at home for, clo for close on two years, they just want to go and splurge, unquote, according to Mary Ann Ong, representing the Regional Tour Operators Association. Yeah, interesting point. I urge those who are watching this video go t check out that article in detail. But interesting point brought up in that, in that article is, yeah, folks really are, I suspect after two and a half years in most cases, folks really are gung-ho about having a good time and having a nice long good time, a good relaxing good time after being cooped up for so long. And I, all I can say is, look, Thailand's here to welcome you. You know, we're, we're all happy to have the tourism back. And, you know, so-called revenge tourism, if that's what you want to call it, if you want to take your revenge for not having had a vacation in a couple of years, more power to you. I totally understand, you know, it's time to have a good time and it's time to relax and chill out after being basically all wound up for a couple of years at this point. And I definitely think Thailand's a great place to go for, you know, exacting one's revenge in terms of tourism. So, yeah, I think it's all a good idea. I think I'm hoping, based on what, you know, tourism authorities are saying and, and folks in the tourism sector are saying, hopefully we're going to see a major uptick in the high season these coming months. Hopefully that'll happen sooner rather than later. 